Baylor School reports eight cases so far and class has yet to begin. School officials are testing all students before they arrive on campus to cut down on the amount of positive cases inside the building. Our Travis Cummings visited the satellite testing site today for a sneak peek of what students are seeing. It's a pretty smooth process. About 15 vehicles come through here every 30 minutes to get tested. And then even more conveniently, their samples are taken right over to the lab on campus. It's Baylor School's way of making sure that their campus community stays free of COVID-19. Hi. Yes. Since the start of the coronavirus pandemic, the Baylor School has been instrumental in community testing. And we've got a, a very small number of, uh, and percentage of positives, so I think our families have done a good job taking, you know, keeping their kids safe this summer. With a new school year ahead, the focus is now on those teaching and learning on campus. And we're going to be able to not just do that before the start of school and identify any issues we have before school starts, but we're going to be able to do surveillance testing during the course of the year to make sure that our community is staying safe. The school set up a protocol to test all employees and students through their health center on campus and this drive through testing site. President Scott Wilson says with their scientists in lab, they can turn a test and provide results in less than 24 hours. We do the tests. Um, get the results and then and then enter it into all the um, the county and other systems that are that uh, are required of us. Health Center Director Mary Catherine Robbins ensures multiple layers in place to keep both facilitators and those coming through the line safe. They're filling out a questionnaire first to check health history and everyone is required to mask up. We do not want people that are feeling unwell to come onto campus and then there are many layers to disinfect and clean since we know that a lot of kids um, and a lot of individuals in general are asymptomatic with this illness. And while they recognize there's anxiety for people returning back to campus, staff say they're committed to doing everything they can to prevent the spread. This whole thing from the beginning, it's all about working together as a community at Baylor and even beyond that as a community of Hamilton County. It's, it's been a long time coming um, and it was neat to see uh, all of it come together. Satellite testing will run until this Sunday for students who test positive for COVID-19. Their information will be sent to the Hamilton County Health Department and they're also given an option to quarantine right here on campus or at home. For those day students, they can stay at home as well. Reporting in Chattanooga, Travis Cummings, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you.